2023 and we cross over to the coast region which was all jubilation in some of the schools across the coast region as the 2023 KCC exams results were announced. For Lamu Governor Issa Timami, it was all smiles as his son was among top students who scored an A plane. Some of the schools for the less privileged which sat the exam for the first time are also celebrating good results. Tobas Chanji has this and other highlights. <laughs> Once again, Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed was among the core schools that produced top students. One of the students, Lamu Governor Issa Timami's son, Abdallah Issa Timami, topping the list with an airplane. I feel very lucky to have done well in the KCC examinations. As so far, we have eight. We have eight from the four from the boys and four from the girls. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, and we have so many A minuses and B plus. Another school, Light Academy, which had 66 candidates. They just had two strong A's, while the last candidate got a B minus. Uh, there's a lot of pressure from our parents and our teachers to work extra hard. I want to become an architect. My dad inspired me because he's an architect. I'm in Ipatia pride katika jamii kwa sababu katika malezi sikuizi watu wa kiume wana shida sana. Una mitandao na madrags ya lioko hapa na uhalifu kila aina. Some of the giants that maintained their good performance included Shimo Latewa Boys and Mamangina Girls High Schools. With 392 registered candidates, Shimo Latewa had four A's, with the last candidates getting a C+. Plus. The target we had actually, uh, we had uh, targeted for men of eight. Um, we are praying we reach there. Even if we don't, we believe a men of seven something will be able to... To At Mamangina Girls that had 237 candidates, Sharon Wanjiku topped with an A as the school registered a mean score of 7.4. But so far we have one A plane from a girl called Sharon Wanjiku and 11 A minuses. But we are still checking because of the fact that they are not arranged according to their capabilities. The trend was similar with the Kuali Boys and Matuga Girls High Schools. Some emerging district level schools for the less privileged who performed well for the first time. Tobias Shanji, KT News.